<laughs> wait, 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 wait. Is that, are we talking about Jake the dog or Jake as the snake? <laughs> no, as the picture that they're in. So he's Jake the buff snail. Here, Finn, this time you be the chick and I'll be the snail dude. Hey, baby, what's up? Hello, everyone, and welcome to uh, the Out of Fluff fucking channel. Today, we have for you a motherfucking tier list. This tier list is going to be based on, um, how should I put it? Uh, basically, if they could still, if they could still your bitch or not. Or, um, mans, I guess you could say. So right now, today, I actually have some fucking guests. So first off, we're going to start off with, uh, Burrito, if you want to go ahead and introduce yourself. Yeah, it's, uh, it's your man's Burrito, a.k.a. the Chattahoochee Coochie Man. Okay, so we have our Burrito, a.k.a. Chattahoochee Coochie, Coochie Man. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking try, no try, 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 try to say that shit three times fast. <laughs> and next up we have is Potato. You want to go ahead and say something? Something. Cool. Now introduce yourself. Potato. <laughs> My name. <laughs> don't, don't, cool, 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 cool. Don't wear it out. <laughs> but please don't. Just anytime potato talks, just it's just a potato in the corner. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. So now that we have this tier list going on, first up, we're gonna start off. Uh, the top is gonna be from Never to Be Seen Again, as in, yeah, you're. Your significant other is gone for the rest of your life. You're not going to see them no more. Oh, all the way down to kidnapping to where... Yeah, all the way down to kidnapping to where you won't see them again, but at, at least they didn't free will and walk away. Now we're going how they look in the picture or just them in general? The pictures, specifically the, the picture. Yeah. We're going straight yeah. off of the pictures of how they are. So first up, we got his uh, SpongeBob. With the anchor arms. SpongeBob muscle yeah. pants, you mean? Hey, so, I mean, oh yeah, SpongeBob hey. muscle pants. <laughs> I'm gonna say, look. Yeah, they gonna figure with, it out. With the arms. <laughs> yeah, they they're gonna come back. But he had everybody fooled for at least a day. So yeah, like it. It's definitely one of those like he'll he'll pull up real quick. He'll get he'll fool you enough, <laughs> and then it'll just come out pretty quickly that he does not actually have those arms. Yeah, no, honestly, I probably wouldn't even say it will be like a fool tomorrow, but one hundred percent like they'll be leaving. Dude, if somebody pulled up to me with those fucking airbags, bro, take my wallet, <laughs> take my bro, take whatever. Well, bro. All I need is a jacket, and yo, look, he's good right there. Little shirt. But he's confident enough to walk up to walk out in public in a speedo, bro. That's I'm not trying to fight that guy. He he like walks on his arms as well. Yeah, his arms he's like, fucking everything. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, well, he said fuck leg day, bro. Right, bro. Yeah, look at his legs. Lift up his whole body, but couldn't lift up a glass of drink. No, yeah, his strength That's feats crazy. are. Yeah, we're talking about power scaling, SpongeBob. <laughs> yeah. <no. laughs> <laughs> we're, we're not talking about that. We're talking about it. if, if he can still get bitch. Easily a galaxy buster, if you ask me. <laughs> you know, I think he's right. cosmic level. If you really get down to the nitty gritty, bro, look at him. His durability is crazy. Oh, durability? There's no beating it, bro. He's, that man was squeaking at punches, bro. All right, next up is uh, Archer. Never to be seen again, bro. That that man will come in and take your bitch, bro. Is Archer, besides sodomizing my fiance, what? Only by the strictest legal definition. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah. No way, bro. Like, Arch Archer coming. Oh, potato. You haven't watched uh, Archer that much, have you? And not really. I've seen it enough Aww. of. Well, my Chattahoochee Coochie Man is an Archer reference, but um, he's he's 
gay enough too to take your man's too. Like it ain't ain't nobody safe, bro. I seen the episode where he kissed Ramon. <laughs> that man was straight and. Oh, you seen that? Yeah, he was taking everybody. Yeah. Now, on Jemima. Talking about thick bottle and Jemima. <laughs> Me personally, I'm more of a Buttersworth. Oh, Miss Buttersworth. But hold on, I'm gonna take a break from this list real quick. <laughs> Go check my <laughs> fridge <laughs> real quick. Give him a couple minutes. <laughs> yeah. This is a quick, quick intermission. <laughs> Maybe a couple waffles. Yeah. Maybe waffles. But I'm making. Making the whole fucking cake, bro. Uh, <laughs> All right, well, but we'll, which one would you guys? I personally say no chance. I'm just I, I say fifty fan. fifty. But are we talking like like OG bottle and Jemima. She, they had to ban her because she was so thick. Couldn't have something that she thick. Th- oh, she thicker than cold syrup, man. I'm saying facts. <laughs> <laughs> she as thick as cold Wait, syrup. I, mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think. <laughs> All right, so so y'all saying 50-50? Yeah. I mean, she might take me, you, not my girl. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, <laughs> that's crazy. Um, Next up we have is Bane. That's a kidnapping, bro. Bane's a kidnapping. Yeah. <laughs> there ain't, no, ain't no buts about it, yeah. bro. That man just going to throw... You going to kidnap her and break her back? <laughs> <laughs> just Just for fun. <laughs> You gonna try to stop him, and he's gonna break your back. <laughs> hey, you know what? He might bring her back in a wheelchair. Yeah, you know what they say: once you go black, <laughs> you gonna need a wheelchair. <laughs> <laughs> nah, he's he's for sure kidnapping. I, uh, uh, Barney, I I would say he's kidnapping. Do my life, dude. Yeah, bro, look at that menacing oh, face. Oh, oh. Hey, love mama, let me whisper in your ear. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Dude, yeah, no, bro, he's definitely kidnapping. No, he's, Bar- he's putting them inside of the suit. <laughs> Barney is wild, bro. That's a kidnapping for sure. Yeah, bro, he's going to kidnap some... He's going to fucking pass him out, kidnap him, put him inside the suit, and go inside the club. All right. Hey, Barry B. Benson, though. Oh, sure. You coming? This man thing? will not only, Again. bro, not Dude, he pulled a human. Not even will he steal your girl. <laughs> he will gaslight you into thinking he's not trying to steal your girl. He'll have your girl gaslighting you into thinking like he's a bee. Why would I ever leave you for him? Man's is right. Tell <laughs> 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 the bee stole his girl, bro. Like, I'm helping him sue the human race. Yeah. Like, what? <laughs> Yeah, dude, that, so, that that was crazy. Who, Cause what was it, Patrick Warburton that voiced like her Actually, boyfriend or whatever? Perfect, like uh, I would say that he is above fucking Archer. Dude, yeah, a bee pulling a human, like ah, uh, nah, that's yeah, just wild. that's crazy. The bee voiced by look Jerry that, Springer. Look at, look at that look. Yeah, bro, that's why I had to pick it, man. <laughs> All right, is that the the bird from Rio? Cause no chance, bro. Bro couldn't even fuck when he was the only one left of his race, bro. He had one job was to fuck, and he couldn't even do it right. <laughs> bro, I just wanted to see yo, cause he had kids and stuff like that. Yeah, but what yeah. Do you think if if he was in that, if he found that whole flock, like if he found her in that whole flock, like in the second one, no chance, no them. chance, bro. Yeah, no. He would just. Die alone, no kids. That's, that's uh, a cat woman. That, uh, that's never to be seen again, bro. That's uh, and then you know what? I'd be okay with it. I'd be like, yeah, I'd be what? okay with it. I, I would just wish it was me. Is all I'm saying. Okay. I feel like I can't put it up there because of the fact yeah. that of how well, cat she's is. a like, she... woman. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy. I was gonna say because I was gonna say because she was a thief, thievery. Leave them like in the morning. You don't think women can steal your girl? Yeah, no, I'm about to play Catwoman as see them tomorrow because she's gonna leave. I feel like Catwoman only does one night stands. That's fair. You wake, even you wake up, and you're like, oh damn, she's gone. What the fuck? 
with hey, all my with your whip marks too. all over your back too. <laughs> yeah. Close to the bed. Fucking Rob. Like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Chef is another. He's probably just another one night stand person though. Like I feel like yeah. Chef could, but it's just like a thing. Yeah. Do you want more? Gonna lay you down by the fire. And caress your womanly body, make your moan. He's like the, uh, he's like the penny he, drop. He, yeah, he was like a Playboy type of dude, you know. Like he was like, he was like sleeping around. Yeah. So we all agree, just see them tomorrow. Yeah. I would say like, let's drop SpongeBob to the bottom and see you tomorrow, because his is coincident. His is like accidental. See you tomorrow. His is not intentional. Yeah. <laughs> His is his arms deflated overnight, and they're like, oh. <laughs> no, like, his is barely, like, 50-50. Yeah. Like, I think it depends on the situation, honestly. Older Spongebob, but, yeah, but not... not is that not the man Chester Cheetah, bro? That's a kidnapping. Chester Cheetah. <laughs> <laughs> it's not easy being cheesy, bro. God, there's no fucking drummer better than Neil Peart. It ain't easy being cheesy. Yeah, dude, they're gone. Bro, you're gonna, your girl's gonna disappear. You just got Cheeto dust all over you, and you're gonna be like, "What the fuck just happened?" <laughs> just a Cheeto handprint. Yeah, yeah it's Cheeto and then, But the crazy thing is, and and to get her, 100, it would be like the red fucking Cheeto dust. Oh she, damn! He got her off of the hot Cheetos. Oh. Well, well, that's Hispanic women, bro. That hot Cheetos. That's all they. That's all they know is hot Cheetos and that's fucking... A, yeah, that's a, that's a trap right there. Yeah, kidnapping. Yeah, kidnapping. <laughs> all in, hey, you all know Hispanic what? I'm going the chance. Nah, bro, that man d did steal the girl, oh. bro. What do you mean? Never to be seen again, bro. Flame Princess? <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. That is, right. <laughs> that is right. He did do that. <laughs> he did. I was gonna give him 50 50, but I, I forgot he did it. He actually did it. You he, gotta give him credit. He's that guy. He's that guy. Then when Finn tried to slide back in, he's like, uh, no. Yeah, no, he got that down. Clank. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Probably above the bird. I'm sorry, at least. Blake. <laughs> Um, yeah, Clank can actually like not, understand emotions. Yeah, blue, blue's just stupid. Like at least above the bird, probably not higher than anything else that falls in no chance, but at least above the bird. <laughs> yeah, you know, considering the B is the number one. <laughs> <person so far. laughs> Let's get the robot just a little bit above the bird. All right, what is that snake? All right. No, this is Captain Price. I don't know who that is. What is that? From some, uh, Modern Warfare? Some Call of Duty shit? Yeah, from MW, MW2. I don't remember that. He was the, he never, was the man that they uh, went to go get in uh, MW2. Never played it, bro. I don't even play first oh, person shooters, out. bro. Yeah, what kind of person are you? I only play 2D side scrollers <laughs> and uh, in Fortnite. <laughs> Hit him with that Fortnite dance. I actually only play turn-based. I'm taking a piss real quick. I play real-time okay, okay. strategy games and nothing else. Yeah. <laughs> God, dude, those people. Those people are different. Are we going to wait for him? Or are we going to keep going? Uh, I don't know. I don't know much about this guy, so that that I'm going to defer to you guys for this guy. Uh, I would just say 50-50. Yeah, man. big old robotic, Sir. robotic dingling. I feel like, I feel Wait, like he's nice him? enough to oh. send them home. Oh, are you cool with uh, Captain yeah. Price? Uh, Potato, you cool with Captain Price? I guess, yeah. Man, a guy yeah. in the military. Any bitch. Alright, Cyborg. So, does he get a robot penis? Because I feel like that's going to really decide... Look, man, if we're basing off of the videos seen on uh, Red 2... we're basing off the picture. Basing off the picture. Basing off of the picture? Yeah, that, that version of Cyborg. Is it robot dick or real dick? Because... I mean, I'm not seeing any... Well, what, what parts of his body is actually... 
screaming and then just like his arms and like his head because it was like a car accident right like he got hit by a car yeah he's like his pieces i, I guess I, where it, they put him it back might together. be robot dick because his legs are definitely like fully robotic yeah. i'm pretty sure i mean like yeah, probably. Not that it matters, because it's not like you don't see, see it anyway. Much uh, that much. I'm gonna... <laughs> you know, just... Yeah, do, do... yeah, no worries. Yeah, this is, this is all for just education. Yeah, yeah this is this just purposes. so everybody is aware that we are judging based yeah, on the fact... Yeah, but would he be a nice, of a nice enough guy to send them home? Like, he, yeah, you know... I think so. I think he'd definitely, like, send yeah. her back so I'd to say, tomorrow. I'd say, like, 50-50. Yeah, because there's a chance... Like, you know, he's, like, a superhero, so he'd be like, you know... He, he can have that game, but I feel like... It's it's gonna be the robot part. That's fifty fifty. Like you guys, it's like, are they really gonna trust like that? If it's like metal down there, or what? Oh, I thought you were talking like if he trusts his his other half. See, the the, the reason I bring up the penis is because now we have to talk. Well, about I Cyril. have to get Cyril. Who's on? Framboise. Oh, hello. 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 Oh man, that's bad. <laughs> Who is renowned for having a fucking 12 inch monster, bro? He got that anaconda down his fucking pants, but he got no game. So, no game. So, he got it, puts him in no chance for me. You, you, you have to have like some type of game, bro. But see, now here's the thing though, because he still got Lana. That's the only reason I'd say we put him in 50 50, bro, because. True. Lana, bro. <laughs> Lana. Yeah, but is that like? And he got. Oh, uh, because there were some parts that like Lana just, and because she was just trying to get at Archer. Because right, well, we got Lana, he got Cheryl and or Carol, Archer's mom. True. True. Ooh. Pam. But who did it with Archer's mom? Ray. Um, Trinette. I think he got everybody in the office. He slept with Trinette as well, the the like Irish hooker. The the only one And Barry's fiance. The eight the French chick. <laughs> the only one that he did it was the guy on the The one that keeps getting just shot oh, just randomly. Brett? Yeah. Him and uh what's his face? The Nazi dude. I think he also slept with Scatterbrain Jane. Like, Damn, it might just be a scene. It might just be a scene. Of... I, I, he got all these people on the show. I think it's at least 50 50. Like, because it, it's like a, it's one of those weird well, things where it's like. Now, it, his is over time, though. Yeah. I would say that Daryl was definitely an over time. Like, you bump into him in the street, he's not he's not doing it. But, like, yeah, you know, like, if they, like, him and your girl work together, then, yeah, he's eventually going to get there, you know? Yeah, so, I, yeah, I'll say 50-50 then. Like, if, if your girl tells you, like, that's her co-worker, like, I, I'd be just a little worried. <laughs> <laughs> Go in there and I'd just start Because he is fire. a sex addict. <laughs> like, he's... He is definitely a sex addict. Like that is a that is a core part yeah. of his character. So, <laughs> all right. Do y'all want to introduce yourselves, or you want? Uh, I am known as the Chattahoochee Coochie Man. <laughs> all right. I'll, after that, you will be introducing yourself. <laughs> <laughs> You smell good. Did you take a bath in rainbows and cupcakes? 